know sometimes we think that uh, this is our value but in fact we, we are living different life and uh, by uh, our everyday actions in our life we prove that actually our values are different uh, so being honest with yourself, uh, being conscious about own, your own values and priorities in life is very important. If when you know what you want from life and what you want to, to achieve and uh, what is like guideline in your life, then it's uh, easier for you to make the decision, easy, it's easier for you to make the right choice. But as for compatibility, uh, you can ask your girl to do the same and then you compare your lists and uh, possibly can find out that you have uh, something in common. Hello, my dear subscriber. I'm uh, happy to get back to you. And uh, I chose such a topic for our next videos as the compatibility factors. And uh, in each video, we will discuss um, one of compatibility factor factors that exist and that are influencing your choice and um, I hope these videos will be helpful for you, it's usually useful and when you go to a date with a woman you will uh, pay some attention to them and uh, you will understand the, pri the priority for them. Of course it's also very personal, individual, but um, still some uh, general uh, things work. And uh, today we start with such a, such a uh, compatibility factor as the values. And uh, it's important to understand first of all your own values. Then when you go to a date, you talk with a woman and uh, you put attention to uh, uh, what uh, she uh, tells as her, as her values. And uh, in this video I will, uh, will tell you about um, the approach, how to find out your real values, because you know, sometimes we think that uh, this is our value, but in fact we, we are living different life and uh, by uh, our everyday actions in our life we prove that actually our values are different. So in, my, in mind we have some, something uh, also different. Uh, so being honest with yourself, uh, being conscious about own, your own values and priorities in life is very important and it is the first step for you to find uh, the person with the same values and uh, build happy relationships. Mm -hmm. uh, and even if you are not thinking about finding someone now, uh, knowledge about your values, being conscious about them, makes you uh, more confident when you make some choice during your life. I mean, uh, in uh, different situations in life, when you know what you want from life and what you want to, to achieve and uh, what is like guideline in your life, then it's uh, easier for you to make the decision, easy, it's easier for you to make the right choice. Uh, because you know when we don't know what we want and what's important for us, someone instead of us will decide it uh, and um, you will be given um, something to do according to someone other's wish. Uh, so better to choose yourself, uh, to know yourself and uh, go uh, to your own goals. Uh, and that is, uh, this is uh, led by your values. And again, as um, it often happens in uh, social field, uh, in um, definitions, uh, there are many understandings of values. Uh, some people tell these uh, some general uh, human values that are, that are important for the whole world, like honesty, uh, like uh, being in constant development, and so on. Some other people uh, name like value something like family kids and so on uh, but um, now I will tell you about the approach one of the approach how to define your values and these values will uh, be connected more with your feelings with your state with uh, how you feel yourself mm, so let's start let's make uh, together the exercise to find out your values uh, of course uh, uh, I do it uh, during uh, private co coaching uh, sessions and uh, we, we uh, give much more time to it, but you can uh, do it at home. And um, if your lady does the same, you can possibly find out uh, how much in common you have in sense of values. 
So the first part of this exercise is to write down the 10 situations in life when you felt the most happy, uh, when you fell, uh, felt excited, uh, when you felt that your life is going the way you want and just the most uh, uh, 10 the most happiest moments in your life do, do this take your time don't be in a worry in a worry in a hurry and uh, just write down these 10 points the second step uh, write down under uh, each of these situations write down uh, how do you how you felt in this situation what types of feelings did you have for example it can be like a joy uh, being the sense of achievement uh, being a winner and so on and when you do it for each point each of 10 points you will uh, eventually have uh, the list of the situation the list of feelings that you had in it and uh, your next uh, step is to uh, find is to read it carefully again these feelings and to find out what uh, which of them uh, were repeating a lot in your list and uh, uh, after all you have uh, from three to five words feelings uh, that are considered to be your values so you see it uh, in this exercise in this sense your values are not considered to be some material objects uh, or Mm, something mm, that you can touch but it's more about your state your inner state and um, uh, just uh, the next step uh, it's not about dividing uh, defining your values but just about more living more happy life uh, try to write down the list of things that you can do in your everyday life and uh, when you feel you'll feel these feelings so if, if you do something each day that makes you happy you will feel um, even more and more happy with every new day but as for compatibility uh, you can ask your girl to do the same and then you compare your lists and uh, possibly can find out that you have uh, something in common in general it's considered a very good uh, uh, compatibility when you have at least uh, 70 uh, or 50, at least 50 percent the same uh, uh, the same values with your second half and uh, then you can move forward uh, and uh, that's it this is uh, such an uh, exercise and you can try it and uh, share with me please uh, what you liked about it what you didn't like if it really fits with your values just share your impressions And also the other approach is just to um, uh, the second uh, type of how to find out what your values are is to uh, write, out, uh, write down what you consider to be important for you in life and then uh, uh, instead and uh, for each point you write down what uh, you do uh, according to this uh, point for example if you put reading uh, or if you put development as your value in this list uh, but you notice that during the month you didn't do anything for this value it means uh, it's not your true value and possibly you can find something else if you uh, it's what i meant in the very beginning sometimes we think we have this type of values but in fact we are doing different things uh, supporting different values and uh, the same happens with people when um, it goes to dating uh, I have many clients who work uh, a lot, uh, who worked a lot in the past to gain uh, a good financial situation, stability in life. And now uh, they came to the stage of life when they want to find love, when they want to establish family, to have kids and so on. Uh, but when we, we go to discussion how much time they devote to finding love at least, or to dating, or to developing relationships with a woman, it turns out that after all um, they can do it very very uh, rarely or they don't don't do it at all during a week during a month or they can have just one date uh, during one, uh, one year 
of course it's um, too little and of course it's not supporting your value about family or finding love uh, and uh, there are some reasons sometimes for this um, sometimes uh, people need uh, psychologists to find out what's happening because if you want something but we don't uh, do anything about it or we don't reach this goal it means there are some um, some things uh, that uh, don't allow us to do it and uh, they are subconscious and sometimes we can't find out uh, just ourselves we need to go to specialists to understand what's really happening mm. so uh, the other approach that we also have um, used in our agency it's um, when you just write down your values go write down uh, uh, write down your values and we can compare how much in common you have but uh, as i told you it's like the general understanding about you and uh, about her and only when you talk to her on a date when you know more about your life uh, you find out your real values mm. and uh, yeah as i told uh, the more compatibility you have in this sense in in values in goals in life uh, the more uh, the more chances for success your your couple has uh, i hope this was useful for you Mm, I hope you put like to this video and uh, of course I'm uh, always waiting for your questions. Please write me, write in comments, write uh, to my email address and we will talk. Thank you for being with me today and uh, we meet in my uh, new next videos and uh, of course uh, in our live streams. See you soon.